Hi. In this presentation, I will be talking about multi kernel, a detailed analysis of multi core OS kernel. This is the outline of my presentation. So, in this project, we will be presenting a novel OS architecture called multi kernel inspired by distributed systems, and it will provide superior scalability compared to other existing OS kernels. We will basically conduct a thorough study on different aspects of existing multi kernel operating systems. Then, we analyze a popular hybrid OS kernel, Windows, and measure its performance with available tools. Based on our primary analysis and results, we try to optimize the system. Finally, we will try to get insights from our study that will help to optimize future hybrid kernels. Though Windows is not a multi kernel in the same sense as some experimental kernels in our survey have appeared, its combination of having features of both monolithic and micro kernel designs make it ideal for testing and analyzing as a prototype in our study. In our survey, we presented some of the existing multi kernel models. First of all, a multi kernel model and its implemented operating system called Barrelfish, which is really popular in the experimental setup, is introduced in, uh, in work of one, where the kernels interact with each other through message passing instead of shared data communication. Their scaling showed that message passing has surpassed shared memory efficiency for distributed system and performs better irrespective of the hardware setting. For measuring performance, the Rayner case study of TLB shutdown, compute bound, and IO workloads. The authors into proposed a practical way to improve the challenges in new OS architecture and represented some of the existing multi kernels called Quest V, clustered multi kernel, Popcorn Linux, IX, Arrakis, etc. And they also proposed a new market kernel called Mysis Framework to bridge the kernel, current multi kernel research gaps. Tools like Chimbuko were introduced to measure performance stress analysis. The objective was to provide scalability of the multi kernel OS through using this tool. Raj Gupta proposed Popcorn, a Windows based tool for popping kernel drivers at scale. Windows provides powerful tools available at Microsoft Store to measure and analyze the performance. So, our research question is that the analysis can help understand the detailed design of any multi kernel OS and their implication. Also, this study will help to get insight to into an analysis of Windows kernel and its performance metrics. This is the materials and methods to, perform, to measure the performance of our Windows hybrid kernel. Windows Performance Toolkit WPT, Windows Performance Recorder WPR, Windows Performance Analyzer WPA, and WinDBG. The above three tools are an effective tool to measure the performance of Windows kernel, while WinDBG is a, is a debugging tool to trace and analyze the issues within the kernel. We will use the above three tools to measure the performance of our Windows kernel. So as per we see that the dynamic analysis of Windows events with WPT, we ran the WPR for approximately two minutes. Buffer size was 471 megabyte and 5% of used memory while running. No events were dropped during this process. After saving the recording, we visualize the performance with Windows Performance Analyzer. The result is shown in figure one. So we see that the system activity computation, disk storage, memory utilization, and system power source in a graphical view. Even tracing and troubleshooting for Windows. So even tracing for Windows is an efficient kernel level tracing facility that allows log kernel and application defined events into a log file. Here we see the log file and trace the statistics for events in details. When we troubleshoot the events, WPA provides the trace statistics and the list of event lists with detailed log as shown in figure two. When we try to optimize the system, different line graphs show in the consumption of CPU resources. And the white line represents the CPU idle time, which does not exist. Since we are performing the dynamic analysis, currently no idle time prevails in there. So in figure four and five here, we see some of the, uh, some of the anomalies in during event tracing. It shows the process and threads respectively inside the system activity graph. Here the process and the threads overlap, which is which will show again that uh, the overlap with threads activity after approximately 24 milliseconds. This can be fixed properly by properly configuring so that threads and process do not overlap. This is just a demonstration to show that possible optimization can be performed by observing the, uh, the graphs generated by WPA in real time. So in this study, we tried to conduct a survey on multi kernel models that are available for academia research and practical implementation in industries. The existing multi kernel models are still under development and have been examined in 
experimental setups. We analyzed Windows kernel with tools in, introduced in our study and are highly sophisticated and efficient in com conducting comprehensive analysis of Windows kernel. The tools are widely used by developers and system engineers to find out the any anomalies in or simply observing the kernel performance. As part of our future work, we will investigate the performance of Windows kernel by debugging it with another powerful tool, WinDBG, to understand the kernel performance better. These are the references. Thank you.